What's going on YouTube? Happy Monday everybody, it's Vikings95 here. In today's video we have something I picked up a while ago, like I don't even know how many months ago. Um, might have even been different times because the boxes do look a little bit different in color. But we have two of these Football Collector's Edge uh, Walgreens boxes. You guys have seen these before, probably in some of my videos. Super cheap, but you know they're... They're cheap and they're fun. I don't know. Um, I've had some pretty decent hits come out of them before. I mean, nothing like super shocking, but I have heard of some cool things coming out of them. Uh, one of the more recent ones I did, I think I got like an Andrew Luck rookie jersey card, which was kind of neat. And so we're going to see what we can get in these two Football Collector's Edge boxes. And I did get both of them from Walgreens. Uh, probably, th I don't even know. It's been... It's been a while since I picked these up, so um, my guess is probably six-ish months ago would be my guess. And we have, oh man, we have a uh, Trojans Panini pack. We'll see if we can get anything there along with a LSU Tigers pack. So let's hope the second box is different. Let's see. Usually... Not the best pack-wise. Um, I have heard some people, there was like a brief time where they actually had like decent packs in here. But uh, I would be surprised to see that. So, looks like this one is a 90s, 1990 Premier Edition, one of the uh, Junk Wax era packs. But I do see a rookie on top of that pile, so we'll see. We'll see how it goes. All right. Um, I'll do this pack first. We'll start off with the sealed packs. So we have the LSU trading cards here. Don't know if we will know anyone, most likely not, considering how long ago is this made? Uh, 1991, offers good through 1991. So we are a little late on this coupon, sadly. Um, but we have the WT Robinson Complex, Sid Fournette, Jeffrey Dale, Benji Thibodeau. Andy Hamilton, Roy Winston, Brad Davis, and Billy Joe Booth. So a bunch of LSU guys I've never heard of. Let's see what we can get out of the Trojan Panini Pack. I have got a hit out of one of these before. I got a hit out of a, uh, man, what was it? TCU. I got like a Trayvon Boykin jersey card. So TJ McDonald, uh, Cedric Ellis, Ray, we have a backwards card. What are the odds? Ray Malaluga. And I don't think it is a hit. It's just backwards, I believe. Sadly, it is. I don't know if that's like a gray insert or something. Wes Horton, Frank Gifford, Nicola Vucevic, Marcus Allen. There's a name I know. And DeMar DeRozan. So there's two names I know. Uh, still nothing super crazy. But let's see what we can get in the loose cards. Every once in a while, they do tend to throw in a gem. So we'll see. Uh, I mean, condition-wise, might not be a gem, but at least a decent rookie card or something. Albert Bentley, Vincent Jackson, Jack Del Rio, a Viking, a Jeff George, Herschel Walker, another Viking. I mean, eagle in the the picture, but was a Viking. Anthony Smith, Anthony Green, a Courtney Roby, tops turkey red. Oh man. Cortez Kennedy, Jeff Alm, a, I mean, maybe I needed that back, Lincoln Kennedy, Sean Dawkins, Trace Armstrong, Chip Low Miller, Jay Schroeder, and let's see, Justin Tucker, Tyler Lockett, Brandon Graham, Brandon McManus, Earl Campbell. Now we do get some of these Leaf exclusive reds. So Brandon Ayuk, right? I think they're the box exclusive reds, but they're Leaf. Brandon Ayuk, Antonio Guinea Golden, DeAndre Swift. We did get a red Tua and a Dick Butkus flashbacks. So let's keep that red Tua on top. Not, not terrible rookies. Not bad. Could see if we get like a Joe Burrow or a Justin Herbert or something. So this one only had one pack. It is the Fleer Premier Edition 1990. Before I was born. Derek Hill, Andre Ware, 
NFL draft choice, Andre Ware, Mike Walter, Gerald Riggs, Anthony Munoz, Ken O'Brien, JT Smith, Bruce Hill, Dave Craig, Mike Mike Kofer, Dennis Gentry, Pat Swilling, Tony Mandrick, Evan Cooper, and Brian Williams. So, Andre Ware, NFL draft choice card. Here we go. Let's see what we got here. I saw a uh, an 86 card. How cool would that be if it was like Jerry Rice or something? <laughs> Not keeping my hopes up. Marcus Davenport with our first rookie of the opening, potentially, besides those Leaf cards. Hey, there we go. A Chase Young Select rookie card. Not bad. Ian Book, Pete Werner, Thomas Graham, Brandon Stevens, Richie Grant, Jalen Waddell, Tylan Wallace, Kenny Yaboa, Stevie Scott, Khalil Herbert. Those are all rookies right there. Big pile of Sage Draft. Mike Singletary, Alan Pickett, a Joe Theismann. A little throwback there. Oh, let's see. Let's see. Who's the next one? Who's the oldie? Oh, Sean Farrell. But that Joe Theismann is a 1983 Joe Theismann. Crazy. Sean Farrell with the uh, 86 set. Yep, 1986 set. Actually looks in pretty decent condition. That would be cool if it was a Jerry Rice. Sadly, it's not. <laughs> um, Thomas Lewis, Eric Allen, Kirk Loudermilk, Russ Grimm, Mark Clayton, a Friar Irving, Irving Friar, Irving Friar, Greg Montgomery, Tim Worley, a MVP theater with the return of the MVP. Who is that? Is that like Corey Dillon or someone? It, I think Dillon enjoyed, does it not say his name? I want to say it's Corey Dillon. Oh, it is. Okay, there it is. Corey Dillon, down at the bottom right. Couldn't find it. And then a Super Bowl X card. All right, so there it is. Nothing crazy. Sadly, nothing crazy. I got to say that Chase Young Select rookie is probably the uh, top rookie. We pulled to a red touchdown Kings from the Leaf. Otherwise, nothing wild. But that's kind of what we expected, so... I'm not let down by any means because I know these generally don't have anything super crazy. One in four contain a hit. So, you know, we played the odds and we did not win this time around. But sometimes that's how it goes. So with that, let me know if you guys have found these at like a CVS, a Walgreens. Uh, there's a couple other stores. Usually it's like the drug stores or convenience stores. Let me know if you found any and hit anything decent recently. Um, I know for a little while there was some good packs being put in there, like 2020 select packs and stuff. So I would love to hear some cool stories about that. Um, but with that, I hope everyone has an awesome up upcoming week. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you later. Yeah.